and Merry Christmas. I hope you are having a great day. This is Christmas afternoon and I got three babies for Christmas, guys. I wanted to share them with you. And we're also going to combine it. And um, this is episodes all in one video. It's going to be episodes three, four, and five of Naming the Baby. Okay, so first off, I want to say that my husband is wonderful. He is an awesome man. He, he's, he knows that I love my dolls. He supports me with my dolls. Uh, he doesn't have anything to do with them himself, but he's glad I have found a hobby that I can enjoy and that makes me happy. And he supports me. He backs me up. He buys things for me. Uh, for my babies and buys me babies and um, Matter of fact two of these dolls sitting here today are two dolls. He got me for Christmas. He got me two of them I'm telling you all that because My husband doesn't understand or know anything about um, You know the artist doll artist and scammers and uh, you know, he, he just thinks dolls. That's all he knows about it. And he has purchased me two or three Ashton Drake dolls through the years. Plus, I have bought gobs and gobs of dolls that he supported me, you know, and allowed me to buy. And, um, but, you know, like I said, he don't know the difference. He, he don't know anything about scammers. He don't know, you know, what doll is what. He just, he looks at them and that's all he knows is he sees a doll. So, two of these dolls are NPK dolls. And I'm telling you all this because uh, I would prefer there not be any hate comments or anything like that because... This is not dolls I personally went out and purchased myself. They're gifts to me from someone that loves me, someone that supports me, someone that's here for me, that spoils me rotten. And these two dolls will be in my collection to the day I die. They are at their forever home. I will never get rid of them, even though they are NPK dolls. They, you can hold them and tell they're not as high quality dolls. They're not weighted. Um, they're beautiful. I have to say that. They're not as detailed in painting and, and their painting and stuff like that. But they're, they are beautiful. I love them. And they will be in my collection forever. I will be featuring them from time to time on my videos. So, I'm just saying all that to let you know I would prefer no hate comments about my NPK dolls because they were gifted to me with a lot of love and support and care and understanding and I will love these dolls forever because of that. Okay? So, the first one is an NPK doll, this one right here. Uh, they don't have any names from the factory because they are NPK dolls. Um, they have a birth certificate that I can fill out, uh, and I'm going to put today's date on it as their birth date, although that wasn't the day they were completed and made, but because that's the day I received them, that's what I'm going to put on their little certificate. I have to fill it out myself. It didn't come filled out. Um, you know, but look at this doll. Y'all cannot deny that she's a beautiful doll. Uh, I'm sorry if she is a stolen sculpt. I understand all that. And like I said, I would not personally go do it by them myself because I, I know and I understand and I 
respect that and I try to support the artist today. But because they were gifted to me in a lot of love and care, I'm going to love these babies and I'm going to feature these babies on my YouTube channel and they're beautiful to me. I love them. But this little girl here, look how beautiful she is. I love her skin tone. She is just beautiful. And yes, her hair is factory rooted. Oh, sorry. She has a hard body. She does not have a cloth body. She's not really weighted that well. Um, so she's not going to be as snuggly, but she's beautiful. I love her hair. Her hair is gorgeous. But I named her Felicia. I did not give her a middle name. Um, I'm going to let y'all do that. <laughs> I told y'all I'm not good at doing that. That's what these episodes are for. So... Her first name is Felicia, so I need a name, a middle name, to go with Felicia. So, uh, leave in the comments below what you think I should put her middle name as. And since we're doing three dolls, uh, I've already told you your name for the first 20 dolls that we name. It only goes in the, the drawing one time. Um, so... You know, if you've already, you know, it don't matter that there's three. What I'm trying to say, it don't matter that the, that there's three <coughs> featured in one video. Um, because your name only goes in the drawing for the first 20 dolls one time. So, if you've already commented, your name won't go in, a draw, in the drawing again. But if you've never commented, your name will go in the drawing if you comment. So, then after the first 20 dolls... Those names would be thrown out, and we would start a whole new drawing over. And again, your name will go in the drawing one time for that twenty dolls. So, and everybody in each twenty, uh, each doll that is named. So, however many dolls I have, that's how many um, times. I see. That's how many people's names can be put but again your name will only go in at one time um no for the very last drawing where what i what i'm doing is whatever name i choose for the middle name of the doll that person that put that name in their name goes in that last drawing whether it's the third or the fourth whatever's the last drawing or fifth whatever's the last drawing uh your name will go in there and if, if I pick your name, um, nah, we're just going to leave it that your name goes in there just one time. Because I may, I may like what someone, one person suggests in several different times. So I, I'm just going to try to keep it as fair as I can and your name will just go in one time just like with the 20 dolls. So... In case you're new and you don't know what I'm talking about, I'm doing an episode of videos where I want you to help me give my dolls a middle name. I've named all of them their first names. I do have a doll, which is an Ashton Drake doll. Her name is Lily Rose, and uh, she came with that name. I kept her as that name, so therefore she has two names, Lily and Rose, and um, it's, I'm using it as two separate names. Sometimes I just call her Lily. Sometimes I call her Lily Rose. Um, or most of the time I call her Lily Rose because that's the way it is, you know, from Ashton Drake. But we won't give her another name since she has two names. But all of my other dolls that only has one name, I'm wanting y'all to help me to name them, to give them a middle name. And so that's what these episodes are for. Um, and like I said, today we're featuring three dolls because I just received these three for Christmas. So I want to, since I'm sharing them with you anyway, I'm going to go ahead and make it as the episode three, four, and five because that's how many dolls will be on the fifth doll. Um, comment on this. You know, if three different people, you know... I want everybody to comment a middle name for all three dolls. 
But whose ever name I pick for Lauren, your name will go in the drawing for the first $20. Um, whoever name I pick for this one, I'm saying it that way because I don't want to tell his name yet. Uh, your name will go in the drawing. Whoever I pick for uh, Felicia uh, that gave you the middle name, your name will go in the drawing. So three different names will go in the drawing unless I choose someone twice or three times, and you know, the names that you picked, then your name will only go in the drawing once. Understand what I'm saying? If your name is already in the drawing, your name won't go in this drawing. Um, just, I'm trying to keep it fair, okay? So everybody can have a chance of, um, you know, being able to get a prize. And like I said, for my new ones that don't know what's going on, I'll be giving away um, either four or five prizes. Uh, and what I'm doing, every $20 that I name, I'm going to choose a name out of what you suggest for each doll. Whose ever name I check, uh, whose ever name that I choose, your name goes in the drawing after we've named 20 dolls. Then we will do that drawing and see who won, uh, wins the prize out of that drawing. Then, like I said, those names will be thrown away. We'll start over with 21 through 40 dolls. And everyone that, that comments uh, and leaves a name, your name, everybody that comments, your name goes in that first, second, and third, possibly fourth, according to how many dolls I have. Your name will go in one time into each of those drawings, and then the name I choose goes into a final drawing. I hope I'm not confusing you. As we go along, just just comment on every <laughs> video, and you, you got it made. <laughs> I, you don't have to understand it. Just All you got to understand is to comment a middle name for every doll I present, <laughs> and you got it. <laughs> so, I'm not good at explaining things. Okay, so the other NP doll, NPK doll that my husband got me is this little fella right here. He is very lightweighted. He does have a cloth body. He is stuffed. He's not really weighted. He's just kind of stuffed with stuffing. Um, I think he's gorgeous with his little open mouth, and you can see his little teeth. He's got brown hair and blue eyes. And I'm not going to take his hat off because he'll have hat hair. <laughs> um, this this is the clothes that all three of these dolls came in today. Now, she did not come in these little slippers. She didn't have anything on her feet. So, I pulled some slippers out of my uh, stash, my baby shoes, and put them on her. Um, but this, he had these little socks. I love these kind of socks. It looks like little shoes. I wish I knew where to find these because I would, that's all I'd let my boys wear if I could have enough of socks to go around and different colors. I, that's all I'd let them wear is those socks because I love them. But uh, I named him Bennett. B-E-N-N-E-T-T. -T. I named him Bennett and he ne needs a middle name. So Comment below with a name that you think would go with Bennett. Uh, I'd like for you to put, like, put Felicia and whatever. Put her name, your first name with it so I can, you know, see it and hear it so I know what I want to choose. Put Bennett and whatever you think his middle name should be. So that's the two dolls. They're both our NPK dolls. They both were given to me with a lot of love, and I love the dolls, okay? Now, here is an Ashton Drake. This is the one my mom got me. I actually picked her out myself. I love her. She's actually prettier than I thought she would be. Uh, whenever the doll came in through the mail, my mom made me take it to her room. And put it in there. She wouldn't even let me peek at it. Even though I picked her out. 
she's been in my mom's room since late October, early November. I think it's more like late October she's been in there, and I could not touch her, couldn't peek at her. Guys, I have to admit, when I wrapped her yesterday, I did peek at her. <laughs> but that was the first time. <laughs> I don't want Mama to hear her. But she'll probably watch this video and hear anyway. <laughs> But I didn't peek at her until yesterday when I went to, or maybe it was, yesterday was Christmas Eve, it was Wednesday, Thursday. It might have been Wednesday, I, I finally got around to wrapping her, and I peeked at her before, I, I couldn't help myself, I had to look at her. <laughs> so I peeked at her before I wrapped her, but that was the first time I laid eyes on the actual doll. <laughs> but anyway, her name, she came from Ashton Drake with the name Lauren. L-A-U-R-E-N. And I'm keeping her name as Lauren, but I need a middle name. So comment below what you think I should name her as her middle name. All right, guys, so we're going to go ahead and get these three dolls done. Um, that will speed up our, our process of these episodes and, and get us to the drawings faster. And, and Because, guys, I've got a lot of dolls. The reason I'm saying that we're going to have four, possibly five drawings is because, you know, I'm doing a drawing after every 20 dolls. So I, at this point, I have enough of dolls to have three drawings before that final drawing. If dolls keep coming in, in my process of doing these videos, it's a possibility I will have the fourth drawing of, like, what I mean is, the first one is the first 20, one through 20, the second one will be 21 through 40. The uh, third one will be 41 through, should be 60. I don't have 60 yet. So 41 through however many dolls I have up to 60 will be the third drawing. If it happens that I get over $60 before I get to the end, $60. Sixty dolls before I get to the end of that. We're not counting the final drawing, but the drawing of actually naming the babies. If I get over sixty dollars, sixty dolls. I keep saying dollars. Then we'll have that fourth draw drawing of naming the babies. Now, if I only have like one, say let's say one to. Um, I'm just gonna say one to five over the the uh, sixty. Say like I have from sixty one to sixty five. We will add it into that third drawing. But if I have over five, um, over that sixty, we're gonna make it the fourth drawing. So, um, and I'm not gonna promise I won't get over sixty because. Guys, I'm sorry. I don't know where. I don't know where. The reason I say I'm sorry, I know you that you that are doll collectors understand. Some of you do. Some of you think I'm crazy, <laughs> even though you're doll collectors. But I have become so attached and so enthused about collecting dolls. I love it. Everyone that comes in. I know I have sold some, but I, it's. It's really through heartache that I had to sell them, uh, sold them for uh, different reasons. Maybe I didn't quite bond with them as much as I did the others, or there was financial needs, or there was a doll I wanted more than I wanted that particular doll, and so I would have to sell one to get another. Or Like my two June girls, I loved those two dolls. I loved them. But they had to just sit there because they were, they were just too heavy, too much for me. So I figured it was better to be able to sell them, give them to a forever home that someone could really uh, do something with them, and me have the money to be able to purchase a couple of dolls that 
I could actually do something with instead of them just sitting there. It was so hard for me to change those dolls because they were like over 10 pounds each. I think they both was like somewhere around 10 and a half pounds each. And it was just hard for me to deal with them. And they're, they're bigger dolls, they're like seven month. And they were bulky for me and uh, heavy. And it was just hard for me as an older person with health problems and arthritis and stuff. It was just hard for me to handle them. So I, as much as I hated to get rid of them, I figured it was better to send them to a forever home that could do something with them and love them and, and you know, cuddle them and whatever, and me be able to get dolls that I could actually do something with. So that's the only reason I've gotten rid of any of my dolls uh, is, you know, if I could and I had the room, I would never have gotten rid of any of them. You know, I just would pile them up. But I am running out of space. I've already, I've got my bedroom full. I've already went over into the living room, storing them, you know, displaying them and having little beds and bassinets and rocker, baby rockers and things in here that I'm putting them in. Um, after a while, I'm not gonna have nowhere to put them. But if I could, I would just buy dolls and buy dolls and buy dolls because I love the dolls. I love them. So I'm not going to promise I won't have over 60 by the end of this giveaway and have four giveaways for the actual naming. Then that, that final giveaway, we're calling it the final one, is where whoever's name I chose for each doll, your name will go into that particular drawing one time. And uh, everybody that comments goes in the, the, as we're naming the dolls. Everybody that comments, your name goes in the drawing. Uh, but the name that I choose will go into that final drawing, the uh, whose ever name I choose. So I know I have said the same thing over and over. I'm trying to, I feel like I'm not explaining it well, that maybe you're not understanding. It's just me and my thinking. <laughs> I have a splitting headache. Uh, I I don't know. I'm just, I'm happy and I'm, I'm joyful and it's Christmas and it's wonderful. And we had a great time last night with our older son and his family. And um, we enjoyed uh, hus my husband and mother and myself we enjoyed this morning opening gifts and uh, we just we've had a good time but I am I'm kind of wore down from all the excitement and all the activity and the doing and I've got a split and headache so in my mind I'm thinking oh I'm just not explaining it good they just they're I can't explain it where they can understand it, but y'all are very intelligent people. I know you understand what I'm saying. It's just me. I'm sorry. <laughs> but anyway, I'm not going to take up too much more of your time. I, I hope you've all had a great day, and uh, I'm looking forward to see what names you suggest for my three babies, Felicia, Bennett, and Lauren. So let's see what we can come up for middle names for them. All right, guys. Thank you so much for stopping by. I hope you have a great rest of your day. And God bless. I will talk with you later. Bye.